Hey y'all, hey y'all, hey y'all, hey. It's just me today, you know, because there is a lot going on in Jersey, but I don't think it requires two people to let you know that Joe don't want to be good with Melissa and Frankie still loves Dello. I'm Elmer Saki and this is Housewives Rewind. So, you know, this episode was the end of Danielle's mozzarella party, right? And Teresa and Melissa were getting into it. And then at the end of that argument, Teresa tells Melissa, if if you want to be in the wedding, you could be in the wedding. Like, ew. Well, like, my question is, if we were going to end up at Melissa being in the wedding by choice or by force, why not just throw her in the wedding? That is its own spinoff in and of itself. Like, Tree gets married, Melissa's the bridesmaid, and baby, all hell breaks loose. Um, But then Melissa said, yeah, no, thank you. Like, I don't heat up my leftovers. Like, if you, if you wanted me, you should have asked me to begin with. I don't want to be in your wedding. I just want to, like, make a big deal out of it every single chance I get. And like, that's gross. Polly is in the way. Dolo, Frankie, Polly, and all of them could be giving us the reality show version of Modern Family, right? And then you've got Frankie trying to make it work. He's coming up with nicknames, Potato Head, Buzz Lightyear. You could fight later over whether or not that's actually enduring, endearing, right? But it's like, this could be something. This could be a moment. Dolo could be sitting back eating her grapes whilst having two men who like love her in two different ways, take care of her in two different ways. But Polly wants to come in here and say, oh, I yeah, am, man. Like, sir, if you're the boyfriend, you're the boyfriend. If you're secure in that, then you're secure in that. So like, why, why aren't you secure in that? Like, why? <laughs> come here, I got a question. At what time is Joe going to let us know that he is completely and totally uninterested in building a relationship with Teresa and that he finds arguing with Teresa and whomever her spouse is more profitable? Because honestly, if you were trying to patch things up, if the end goal is resolve, peace, love, family, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. if that's the end goal, why sit there and talk to Louie? like he was a child at that table. Why is that the way you address issues with the people that you love? No, it's theatrics and Louis said that. Thank you. You're watching Joe Gorga and Melissa Gorga audition for their own spinoff and I want to be the first person to tell you it's not given. It's not. We don't want it. I've seen the clips and everything, but I'm telling you what I need out of next week is for Rachel to really Pull me in. She shared her story this week and I commend her for sharing her story. Um, my pregnancy journey did not look just like hers, but it was also rough. So I am very aware of the billions of things that have to go right in order to have a healthy full term pregnancy. And the fact that she was able to talk about that is commendable. However, get into the housewife of it all. I need baby girl to pull me in. I need her to really make me like her because I'm rooting for her, but I don't necessarily know what I'm rooting for. Like it hasn't gave down as a housewife. And I know that that's a tricky line, right? There is a very, very slim line between coming in too hot as a housewife and not coming in and doing enough as a house housewife. I want to see her give a little bit more i'm giving her permission to come in hot i want to know what you think what you thought about the joe gorga louis of it all talk to us in the comments i promise i'm talking back baby you could have been anywhere on the internet but you were here with us and that is so appreciated i'm el marisaki and this has been housewives rewind